Welcome back to Cursed Mining and today we just have a short little second video this week. We'll be taking a look at the Black Miner F1 Mini, but just one particular detail. Coolers. So the F1 Mini comes as PCB with chip and also the end miner control board. That's it. According to the website, most Intel 1150 something coolers should fit, but I found that not to be the case. I tried Intel stock coolers as well as different low profile coolers and found them all to leave some space between the heatsink and chip, especially the coolers with the plastic mounting screws. So I was a bit desperate at first, but then decided to just customize a cooler. So I have a spare low profile cooler, which also has has the plastic mounting mechanism so I clipped off all the plastic screws and finally the heatsink and the chips do make contact. So now one just has to improvise the mounting options. I could find some spare screws and nuts from another cooler I had lying around and with that it was no problem to mount the cooler like I wanted. Don't forget the thermal paste itself and also don't forget to still always screw in a cross pattern not to have too much pressure on only one side. I can't tell you how this behaves with larger CPU coolers since I had no free one around. So that's already it for today. I really just wanted to quickly talk about the cooler topic if you just received your Black Miner F1 Mini and were also having problems with coolers. On Tuesday we'll have the full first impressions video for the machine so the whole setup process as well as my initial review after one week of running thank you very much for tuning in a second time this week we just had the monthly farm update where i promised from now on we'll be having a look at some different machines as well and there you have it let me know what you'd like to see i wish all the best to each and every one of you happy mining and bye